Hello and welcome to this quick tutorial. It's a very quick tutorial today on how to set the time on your Elite or Super Elite or Light Reader. Uh, setting the time on, on your readers is going to be very, very important because it's going to ensure that the time between your reader and your computer is synced up properly. Alright, so if you are not familiar with the dashboard program, uh, basically you're just going to go ahead and open that up. And as you see up here, I've got a list of, of tabs, and I can close those just so that you can see all that. Um, so I'll close that one. All right, and so it's as if I've got nothing up there, okay? This is probably what you're going to see the first time you use it. All right, so what we're going to need to do is go ahead and find that reader, and we can either click on that, and it should find it for us, and then we can select it, or you can just type it into this field right here, okay? Either way is fine. Go ahead and click connect. Wait for it to confirm that you're connected. You should be able to see the type of reader up here along with the version of the firmware that's being used. And then down here, you should be able to see what the current reader time is next to the current computer time, okay? And all we have to do is click set time. Now you'll notice that little checkbox there. It should, when I click set time, fill in with a check and then go away. Occasionally what might happen, especially if you're using a uh, light reader, is that will fill and this will not change for some period of time. Or it may not change at all. And so what you might need to do is go ahead and click set time again. Either way, it should fill in the correct time that matches your computer time and that way you know you're synced up. Alright, well that's all there is to this. I appreciate you watching.